Can we make our way to the bank? Well, of we course. Oh, yes, yes. Of course. You know what? Why don't I go put my horse in the stable and then I'll meet you right back down here? Is that all right? Yeah, it looks uh, sure. like We're it's gonna, real tired. We, we're gonna need your horse if you need to rest it, though. Oh, we gonna we gonna need the horse to ride out to La Grove. Oh, I was thinking we were gonna get the boat right here, but okay, I'll keep my horse out there. Yeah, yeah. can't get past the bridge of Saint Denis. At that oh point. yeah, you are correct. Now, Granny, would you would you like to ride on the back of the horse? Oh, I mean, I appreciate the <laughs> uh, All right then. Well, Miss Elvani. Yes, just have you seen the entertainment for that right. this way in Saint Denis? Uh, entertainment. Yeah. So Wesley, he works for the theater here in Saint Denis. He's out in Blackwater scouting for talent. Oh, that's interesting. Uh, what kind of talent is he looking for? actors and whatnot mm, I'm not much of an actor I'm yeah, so, more so of a, a uh, I guess a stagehand maybe uh, somebody that operates the wings maybe oh, okay yeah I think he probably needs somebody like that because he's doing a silent moving picture oh that's interesting mm. sometimes I do those uh, shadow puppets at the uh, at the theater yeah, Crystal might be staying with Skip for this. She's a, uh, now, do, does she raise horses? She wants to. I think she used to, and she's trying to get back to it again. I see. And Melissa, her name is, you said? Yeah, Melissa. She's, she's in Blackwater a lot of the time, it seems like. You know, I, it sounds like I might need to spend some more time over in Blackwater. Things are getting a little bit, uh, things are getting a little bit too rough around here for my liking. Oh, uh, is that it? Mm-hmm. We also went to Valentine the other night on Saturday night for the Elder Society meeting. That's where I've been spending most of my time, but I mean... That's right. Eustace, did you want to get the horse out? I don't know. Um, so they're getting it, uh, the boat out somewhere else. So is that what I mean? Yeah. Yeah, yeah it sounds going. like we got to go up closer to the swamp or something. Go into the swamps. We just realized we could rent boats today and we let Skit know because Skit's wanting to rent boats and take people back and forth from San Denis to Blackwater. Oh, is that one? Now that's an interesting idea. Mm -hmm. Oh, pardon, I'm sorry. Well, hello Ooh, there, young lady. Pardon, don't mean to block the road, I'm sorry. I have a question for you guys. Well, go right ahead. Um, have you guys seen anybody named Sue around here? Granny Sue? No, not Granny Sue, just a regular woman named Sue. Mm -hmm. no, Can't but... say that I have. I haven't seen okay. anyone. All right, well, thank you. All right. If, if we run into this Sue, can we can we tell her uh, someone was looking for her? Tell her Anna Marie is looking for her. Thank you. Anna All Marie. Right. All right, Anna, Anna Marie. Marie. You take care now. Thank you. You too. Yeah. Oh, that horse is excited and ready to go. May May, your horse is happy and ready. Mm -hmm. Jumping and. 
This is the horse I won at the raffle. You won, you won that raffle? horse at a raffle, did you? $50 for a, a oh, Hungarian wow. half. Now, day. hold on. I think I might have seen this horse. Was that that raffle that was going up going up in Annisburg? Yes, sir. I know uh, Clementine out there. So we had to, oh. of course, Blackwater had to go up there and support our fellow businessmen. Yeah, I met a fella by the name of Luther who was, oh, uh, he and a friend of his were walking around selling, selling raffle tickets for that horse last week. Well, congratulations. I love this horse. It's pedal. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah, Luther told me that's like a... That horse is worth like three or four hundred dollars or something. Oh, my. Yep. Mm -hmm. Yep. Uh. They, they actually, I didn't think I won because Luther didn't give me, like, numbers, but I was one of the first people to buy the tickets. And then another gentleman took over the raffle. And when he said my name, he said it odd, so I, I was like, oh, I was all sad because I was like, I didn't think I won. And then they were like, oh, that's that's you. I'm like, oh, it's me. Well, that is amazing. Very nice. All right, do we have everybody? Oh, no, we are still waiting on someone, were we? Oh, no. Oh, it's just us. All right. Shall we lead the way then? I'll follow. Did you see that restaurant to the left of us there? Don't forget he could charge people two dollars and fifty cents to go to one of the islands out in the middle of the river, but you have to pay fifty dollars to get back home. Now that's a smart business plan right there. Yeah. Well, it's a shame he's no longer working as a butler, but it sounds like that tell-all book is going to be quite interesting. Oh, quite the scandal. I can't wait mm -hmm. to see what happens in that book out a chapter at a time people are going to be so ready for the next chapter you know i was at a dinner party at that mansion one night with my wife and uh i could tell from that very night that there was going to be a whole bunch of scandals occur there I'll try to line it up with the docks if y'all want to go stand over there. Oh, that's oh, very kind. Oh, that's 
This is one of the biggest boats I had. They didn't have one of the steamers. Oh, all right. Well, we'll take what we can get. Mm -hmm. Now, but how much a boat like this costs to rent? Ten dollars. But somebody can sit behind me. Two people can sit in front of me, and then one fellow probably gonna have to stand. Well, I'll, I'm happy to stand up. Whoops. Huh. You better you able to get behind me there, Eustace? Oops. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, no, it's alright. Open the box. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Okay, let's see if I can see it. Might be too many on the boat for one person. Oh, there goes, I think, Granny, are you, are you sitting? I, 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 I think so. Alright, how about now? See if you can sit while I'm standing up here. Because usually I couldn't take hold of the oar if somebody was standing next to me. Yeah, I can get sat. It's alright then. All right. I'll just stand. I should be fine. You know, maybe I'll scooch up here. Come here. Oh, yeah. my, my pants are just a little bit wet, but I'm all right. All right. Yeah, we'll be fine. Oh, there we go. All right. All right. Oh, oh, oh you were able to, to sit there, Granny. <laughs> yeah. My. Yeah. It's a. Uh, I don't know how you'd explain it, but yeah. Uh oh. Did we lose Eustace? Sit in the extra seat there. That's that's all. Yeah, I've tried. Oh, I apologize about that. I'm just glad to see you all right. This is dangerous waters. Yes, they are. Okay. Uh, if you all can right. sit in the extra seat there, I have trouble with it. All right, Miss Granny is the gator spotter, so if uh, anybody gets eaten, it's going to be because she didn't spot him fast enough. Granny, do it. I'll do my best. All but right, I then. It's not frightening. This would be the boat that a gator jumps into. I don't say that. You tell no. me that now? Uh -oh. I would taste just, uh, my skin is so rubbery, I, uh, I just wouldn't taste good. You just take those oars and you push them away. That's right, we'll beat them with them. Yeah. Yeah. So, Mr. Pappy, I'm, I'm kind of, uh, curious. Mm-hmm. How is it that you, uh, became married to a nun? Well, now, Don't Granny, no, not at all. You see, she, uh, she and I have been married for about 10 years. And, uh, now, of course, she wasn't a nun when I married her. Uh, but even though she is a nun currently, uh, you know, it, it's not like a Catholic nun or nothing like that. It's, uh, you know, it's, it's her own church and they're very progressive. So, uh, you know, that explains why we can still remain married. Well, yeah, that explains quite a bit. Mm -hmm. Now, have you met my wife by any chance? I have, I have had a couple of run-ins with her. I mean, yeah, the couple bango, of... and then... Uh, oh, I mean, I yes, of course, day. you mentioned you were at the bango. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I uh, met her one day in uh, San Denis, or San Denis, sorry. And uh, it, um, yeah, she, uh, she ran into me on the sidewalk. She was looking for a lady in a dress, a wedding dress. Oh, I see. Yeah. What, That's what, the two you, times I've met. Other than that, I, I haven't seen her. You were you were about to say something, Mamie? I was just gonna say, who hasn't met your wife? 
Well, she does like to travel, that's for sure. Do you got any children? No, we, uh, we met when we were quite later in life, so we were way past the age of having children. We, we've, we've adopted, you know, a couple along the way, but uh, never had any of our own. There's a person or creature. Ooh, oh, oh I think he done fell. Oh. No, I'm all right. I'm all right. All right. Oh, it's a person on the horse. First. That scared me. Yeah. It is a person on the horse. Yeah, I thought it was a monster. Now, what is a fella doing on a horse in the middle of a swamp? I ain't no oh, fella, that's a lady. Oh, yeah, you're right. Now that I can see. Oh, he's moving now. That must be a very, um, tamed horse. Because I reckon I don't so. Think mine would want to go in the water. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mine would have booked me off so fast, I wouldn't have seen it coming. Yeah, so late. Oh, oh, yeah, no, no, no. Um, okay. Oh. Yep, fast. Good, I ain't staying in this water with no gators. And snakes. Oh, I hate the snakes. Snakes, too. You're right. You, I forgot about them. The snakes frighten me more than the gators. They could be anywhere, anytime. This is an interesting looking place, ain't it? Yes, it is. Man, let's you're made of the sturdy stuff doing all this. I reckon anybody actually lives out here? You're right there, me, me. I was just a little tired. Let's go for some arms for a minute. Well, you take all the time you need. You're about the strongest young lady I've seen in a long time. Be able to paddle that boat as fast as you have. Yeah. Yeah, sturdy stuff. They made one to a cookie. Mm -hmm. I can see that. A lot of you and you got as much uh, br many brothers as I do. Well, how, how many, many brothers you got? Yeah. Seven. <laughs> oh my. Now that is a lot of brothers. Yeah, it is. No sisters then? No, I got a couple cousins but, and my mom, but they don't even know. Mm -hmm. well, I'm sorry to hear that. How old <laughs> were you when they ran off? My mama ran off well, a little bit after she had the youngest of us, oh. but uh, maybe 10 or so. Oh, I don't know if we're going to make this. It's a little shallow. I believe in you. I believe in you. You can try. No. Oh, no. I don't think oh, so. No. I'm hitting my head away. Now, Granny, you know, on the topic of marriage, you ever been married? Oh, yes, I have. I oh. was married for about, oh, goodness. Oh, what was it? Oh, 20, 28 years, yes. Yeah. Well, that's 28 years. Yeah, and I had two wonderful boys, though. Oh, no, man. Uh-oh. Might have to get out and push. Think so. No, I think it's just too shallow in general. I don't right, think maybe we're too heavy. This is where it is. Maybe we can push it. Well, that was a good effort anyway. It was, yeah. Now we can take a break. That's a, that sounds like a good idea.
Over there is the orange field, isn't it? Yes, over there in the distance. Mm -hmm. Okay, uh, I'm just trying to get my bearings here. Sometimes I get turned around. Well, this is the bridge into town. We can always go back and get another boat and go to walk to the other side of the water. And that's more open water. All right, yeah, sure. Oh, there's a somebody on the horse. Uh, that yeah, looks like they turned the around. The, the, the it's the same and the, person. The Are they following me? You think it yeah. floats all the way out here? It looks yeah, like it. Doesn't it? Doesn't it yeah. Did we try? It? Oh yeah. Uh, and we probably can't get the boat through that way either, can we? Mm -mm. But we can go back and get another boat because uh, there's more waterways in the swamp. What if we get another boat? We're gonna get stuck in the same spot, though, ain't we? We're not coming down this way again. We're gonna go oh, on the I other see. side. Oh, all right. Well, I'm game if everybody else is, and I can I can help pay for the another boat. Oh, so we're being followed. Yes, sir. Yep. You think the person on that horse has Pretty been soon. eyeing us? Uh-huh. Yep. Do you recognize her? No. It's just after you see someone three times, you kind of... Yeah, you get suspicious. Yeah, maybe she's just out here hunting or something. I hadn't heard no gunshots and didn't see no bow on her back. You are very observant and correct now that I think of it. That's true. Well, yeah, she wouldn't pull anything funny like, you know, come after five of us now. I hope not. Yeah, she she definitely doesn't want to be in our, our little book. Uh, respect your elders. I was just reading the telegram about the, uh, about some of the topics that were discussed at that meeting the other day. And I and I saw what, Des what had been proposed about keeping track of all the nice young men and young ladies. A little yeah. book of who's nice and who's, mm -hmm. who hates the elderly. Right now Thanks we've got up. Chuck in our book. What you got? Who in your book? Uh, Chuck. Chuck. Now I met a young fellow by the name of Chuck. He got. He was run off the boat from Ireland. Oh, you don't say. That sounds like the same person. Is this the same? Oh my goodness. He what did never this give Chuck fellow do? Last name, so I just know him by Chuck. Yes. Now, now what? Did he say he didn't like old people, or did he do something to show it? I think it was someone else told us that. It was... Who else was there? Was it a Lucy that was there? Oh, it was Lucy that said that? Yeah, I told us that Chuck hated the old people. Well, you know, Lucy is also trying to convince everybody that my wife choked her out. So, you know, since I didn't see it, I have to assume she's lying about that, too. Mm. What? But didn't she? What? Not that I saw. Just because you ain't saying it doesn't mean it's not true. How do I know just ain't everybody just making up stories? 20 people are saying the same thing. You kind of got out of evidence though. I mean, they don't I mean, just hang people. If you didn't see somebody commit a crime and they hang him, are you going to say, oh, it never happened? Yeah, you do raise a valid point now. I can't but, lie. I'm usually blind when it comes to the wrongdoings of my wife. Yeah, I was about to say, but it's good that she has someone that's always going to defend her. I did put a question mark by Chuck's name. It's not been confirmed. If it's not confirmed, they get a little question mark beside their name. Well, mm -hmm. next mm -hmm. time I see that fella, I guarantee I'm going to ask him about it. Then there was a uh, Irma Jean. There's a question mark by her name as well. Yeah, you we could probably told. just remove the question mark from Irma Jean. I, oh, I know how she treats me, yeah, and I, you know, she she probably treats all old people the same way. I see. Uh, the person see, said that she kicks book. people. You know what Granny's got? What's Granny got? I got a shit list. Oh, oh, Granny's shit I see. I like the way you operate. You know what you need to go along with that shit list? You need a switch. Bend them oh, right yeah. over your knee. <laughs> Ask me, me about Granny's switch. Uh-oh. Okay. Oh, oh, Granny already got a switch. All right. 
Yeah, I remember my mother telling me go out there and get a switch to swipe my legs with. I and know so you're I, right about that. I chopped down a limb and brought it into her. She couldn't pick that limb up to swing it. You know, when I was a young boy, anytime I would, I was uh, misbehaving around my granny, you know what she would do? She'd go right to her baking drawer and grab an old wooden spoon oh, and give yeah. me a couple of swats right on my behind. No. I just hope it's not a rusty spoon. No, this one was wooden. Yeah. Somebody else is going to have to rent the, the Oh, let me, the yeah, let me do boat. I got the money for it, but he won't How let much me rent more. Money? It's $10. Oh, I got that covered. What's it called? A keel boat. A keel boat. All right. I ain't on the shit list because Granny will whoop you. Yeah. They may done know. Yep, I've seen it. Well, everybody knows to behave themselves then. Yep. Don't be make me get El jefe abuelita. She'll, she'll whoop you. Oh. Oh, Lord. <laughs> and there's, a, there's another boat, and it's all, I think it's like that flat one over there that's washed up the shore. Oh. We're gonna put it in somewhere else, right? Right, I'm just on the other side here. All right, I rented it, but where do I pick it up? Uh, over here. Oh, I see. They bring oh, it you, over here. you said this was a different waterway, yep. Yep. Mm -hmm. Oh, the big snake. I need mean, just think about boats. All right. Hey, old fish. Oh, that is a big one. Look at the size of that fish. Hi. All right. All aboard. Ooh, the snake's getting ready, getting aboard. The snake is so close. Ooh. Happy, I think you're going to have to roll because it's your boat. All right. Or, or maybe it's because everybody's trying to get, uh, everybody has to get off. <gasps> so that way all right, let's try that. Like circle like the whole time. Old in there. Yeah, that is a big old cafe. All right, let me try. I don't heard that those are, are like eight dollars at that oh. instrument. All right, here we go. Okay, ladies. Yeah, I can't quite see you in the seat, so I, I hope I'm not in your way. Here. Oh, I think you're fine. All right. All right, who are we with? Oh, Eustace, are you in the boat? You look like you might be still in water. I, I'm, I'm in the boat, yeah. yeah All right. Okay. All right, which way should I go? To the right or to the left? There's a gator to the right that just snapped. Which would be your your left, just for clarification. Is it my left or your right? That way, yeah, go that, yeah. Uh, yeah you're going the right way. Yeah, well, here we go. Oh, the growling. Don't worry, if that gator gets too close, we'll just feed Eustace to him. That, then we'll be able to escape. Oh, oh no. It's the end of you, Eustace. I will taste just like jerky. I'll cry if these two are ever separated in life. Oh, oh, that's very yeah. sweet of you. You never know, the gator might like a little Eustace jerky. <laughs> Maybe. He'll be avenged. He will. Definitely he will. Seem to be everywhere around here. They are. I'm just, I can hear him all over the place. Oh, uh, there's one over there. There's one to my right and to your left. I like when you hit him with the boat. It's kind of funny. I'm going to aim for this one right here. Oh, he right. went underwater. We 
got him. I reckon those are the folks that sell the oranges. I saw the advertisement in the pa in the not in the paper, but in the post office. Oh, where's, yeah. where's the orange trees? I don't see them. Uh, all over there. Just to the left of us now. Behind my left or your left? Oh no. Uh, it would be to, to your my, right. To, to, to your right, to my left. There's a little silo over there that's kind of small, and they're just beyond the house. Oh, I see. We heard there's a big cat that roams that area, too. I saw a cat. Yeah, they said to be cautious if you went over to the orange groves. There could be a large cat in there. Oh, goodness. Yes. I saw one on this side of the river over here. Now, them gators are getting awful close. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Just keep... Keep bonking them and do it. Hit them with the oars, it's fine. Well, you think they got cooking in the pot over there? Ooh. There's no tell. G Gator, I hope. Maybe Look, Gator. You can see the big snake from here. Oh. There's a big snake over, out here? Yeah, over there in the trees. You can see it hanging. Oh, there. I see it. Well, you reckon we can get under that bridge in this boat? Yeah. We just have to kind of duck a little. All right, watch your heads, everybody. Uh, going under, watch for spiders under here. That's where they Ooh, get. Spiders. They'll drop on you. Uh. Oh, here's another little camp. I don't know if I'd want my camp to be that close to the swamp. Them gators climb right up in it. I would have to agree oh. with you, Granny. Yeah. Thanks, but everywhere. This is some of the best fishing you'll ever have. Yeah, that's true. This is why I come to Noodle. You know, I asked someone recently if they'd ever heard a noodle, and they, they, they didn't know what I was talking about. I'm glad I'm not the only one on this planet really? that knows about noodling. I don't know it. You don't know noodling? No. This is my favorite place to come out because the way the trees are and the sun sets, it's just beautiful. Mm, look at that sunset. It looks so pretty. Uh, Mamie, you, sh you should explain to Elvani what noodling is. No. Uh, oh. Well, you go, you get in the water, okay, oh. and you take, you take the finger, and you gotta stick it down deep into the hole. You gotta uh -oh. wiggle your finger around for a little while, and something eventually will bite it. And then you gotta mm -hmm. grab it and pull it on out. You pull it right out the water. I'm worried about what's gonna pull me out of the water around here with all the growling. At least good to have a spot, man. Yes, but you gotta be careful because sometimes there'll be a turtle in them holes. Ooh, no. Yes, if you know what you're doing. You can pull out some big old catfish if you put your you put your finger in the right hole, though. Mm -hmm. Oh my! It sounds dangerous, but I'll let other people do it while I watch. Oh, watch it's a good way to fish if you don't have a pole. Yes, I guess so. Well, what kind of bait do you put on your finger? None. You just stick your finger right down there in the hole. Yeah. I heard of people putting a... Uh, like a stink bait on it. Yeah, I suppose you could do that too. And they'll mm -hmm. wiggle their finger. Uh, I've heard of fishing with cheese before. Rub it on a lure and put it in the water. Hmm. Peppy, you know how to make stink bait? Well, when I was a kid, my grandpa and I, we used to just throw all the fish guts right into a bucket. We'd let that ferment a while, and that's what we would use. Mm -hmm. <laughs> we use uh, animal guts, just any animal. Mm -hmm. You let them sit out in the sun for a while? Yes, sir. Mm-hmm. But how do you sit there and fish with the, the gut bucket near you? Oh, no. I mean, yeah, you kind of got to plug your nose a little bit. All right. If I can try, try it. 
if you take the aim trails and everything and you mix it with like you have to like grind them up and then you mm -hmm. mix it in with flour then you have like a cakey stank bait ah that sounds less dangerous less messy yeah it's less prone to spill everywhere or something well it's fishing it's supposed to be a little bit messy yeah i guess I guess it has to be. That's part of the adventure. Mm -hmm. Ain't sure nobody coming out fishing to get clean. Sport. Why, sure. Oh, Pappy, oh, Mimi oh, had... Like that adrenaline rush, what happened? What happened? Pappy, Mimi had talked about going on adventures. She's going to set up adventures for people and charge them a little bit of money to go on an adventure across here or there or to places. Now, that would be something I would love to participate in as well. I thought so. Do y'all see the red in the forest song? I do. It's very scary. Is that a fire? I like it. It's almost, it reminds me of swamp gas. Oh, I've seen that. Isn't that it scary? It is scary. Um, yeah. Uh, Bay May's Misadventures. Mm-mm. Well, you can count me in on one of them. I like the sound of it, too. A friend of mine posted out and it. You know, I had swamp gas once. Oh. But it was right after I ate some bad fish. Oh. <laughs> oh my. I bet that was some serious stink butt. Mm -hmm. I made my own stink bait that night. Mm -hmm. If the fish is eating rotten guts, then oh my. I'd be careful of eating the fish after that. True. Where would, your first... oh. Where would your right. first misadventure be too if you had your choice? Just anywhere. Mm. I reckon it would be up into the mountains to see the giant skeletons and find the squirrel on the mountain top. Oh. The giant squirrel on a mountain top? Mm. Mm. No, there's there's two different things you gotta see. It's the giant that died on the mountain, and the squirrel, that's a cowboy. Oh? A cowboy squirrel? There's a there giant a tiny... cowboy squirrel on the mountain top? What the mm -hmm. hell? Mm -hmm. Is there a tiny horse for the squirrel? I even heard tell that there's uh, some sort of, uh, furry, uh, man-looking thing. It, I haven't found it yet, but I will. Mm -hmm. I think so. I don't think we can get past this bridge. All right. Oh my. All our yeah. horses are in the though. Yeah, I was just thinking that. Well, I mean. Well. Yeah, here's the train bridge. So. Yeah, we can we can walk the rest of the way in town. Gonna have to. Well, we got to see a few different boats today, all different kinds. Ah. Everybody get up all right? Mm -hmm. I've heard a few different times that someone is looking to operate the trains. So we can't do this much longer, or we have to listen. Yeah, I'd like to see that train running again sometime. Sometime soon is what everyone says, but we'll see. Mm -hmm. You know what I hope happens pretty soon? I have been searching for someone that sells a horse and carriage, but I can't yes. find anybody yet. I want a carriage. I saw one to today, earlier today. You did? Yes, but it wasn't a full carriage. It was a little seat, and it had two wheels on it. That's all it had. There's and that one. It was being pulled by a horse, but it had no cover on it at all. Is and that I don't right? know. I don't know if it was a delivery wagon only. Or if someone had managed to find somewhere to buy it. Well, you know, I've seen a couple of them delivery wagons, and them look quite a bit bigger than what you described, but I don't know. I ain't seen all the delivery wagons. Right. Well, this was small. It had one little bench on it, and then it had two wheels, and that's all it was. And Interesting. The, the person was sitting in the middle of it, and it had a lot of lights on it. What you're describing oh. sounds a lot like a little buggy. It kind of was. That's what without, I'm thinking. Without a top on it, it was just a little buggy. 
Now where, yeah. now, where were you when you happened to see that? Um, you know when you're leaving town and you go towards the cemetery, but you keep going down the road that's right. between the cemetery and the little blue hotel that's over right there? Right here in St. Denis? Yes. Okay. It was just on that little stretch of road down through there. It was heading into town, but I was too far away to get to it, and so I don't know much about it. Well, I hope I see that same thing, because I'll have to stop yes. that fella and ask him where they got it. If I had a gun, I would have shot him. <laughs> oh, goodness. Slow down. I want to know more. No, no, I want to have Nobody would have blamed you if you had. I, I think even the law would have defended you. Uh -huh. Yes, they would have wondered also. It's good you're finding out these things, they would have said. So you think there's a fellow around that's selling them? Or just you think find out where he's selling them at? I would like to know. That's what I'm hoping. Or That's someone has figured out how to build them into selling them. Oh, that could be it. Mm -hmm. mm. It was a tiny thing. It didn't look like it could fit more than one person comfortably, but they were there. They were having a good time. All I know is I'd be willing to spend top dollar if I could find me one. That's what we want also. A wagon doesn't kick people in town. Mm -hmm. I need one that sits at least four, though. Imagine yes. if you got your hands on one, though, and you, you, you just started a business straight away. Oh, exactly. Make you a could... killing. Yeah. That's yes. say what I'm waiting on to, to do the misadventures. Well, now we know what's out there, maybe. Possibly. That's very interesting, Elvani. Thank you for Thank sharing you. that. Oh, you're welcome. I ain't come across one yet. Mm-hmm. This looks like a little parkside bench with two little wheels on it being drugged down the streets. I bet it was pretty fast, too. It was. Better have extra springs. I, I don't know if my fanny can uh, stand all the bumps in the roads. Oh, we're getting older now. May, may, it happens. The only fella I know that would ever, well, I feel like be scaled enough to make one would be Yonko out in Armadillo. He's figured out how to make the sold off shotgun. Is that right? Oh, that's nice also. This fella's name is Yonko? Uh, yes sir. He, he mm -hmm. makes, uh, he's one of the first people to, to make them and then everybody started selling them. Interesting. Well, I might have to go out and see if I can find him and ask him if he happens to know where to get one of these carriages to see if he can make wheels and if he can make wheels and that means I can make carriages. That's what I'm thinking too. Oh. You're gonna have to take credit and go make this young boy. I want one of them shot Yeah, he comes he comes at the in the Blackwater a lot. We do business. It's good. They're good people out there. Now that Granny, you telling me you need a sawed off shotgun? Listen, I don't carry nothing much, but when I do want to carry or something, I want to pack a punch and I don't want whatever the hell trying to get me. Yeah, I reckon that would pack a punch, wouldn't it? Yeah. He sells them anywhere from one eighty to two hundred dollars. I was just in Rhodes a little while ago. They had a sign up on the at the gunsmith desk that said they were selling them for two hundred there. So one eighty or one ninety, that that seems like a better deal. Oh, maybe you'll give me a senior discount. Yes, we have to insist on those senior discounts. That's right. Granny Sue runs a little bakery over there in Blackwater, Pappy. Yeah, that's what she was telling me. You never know when a varmint might come through the doors over there, Granny Sue. You gotta be that's a ready. a good point. There's so many cats around. There's a lot of dogs over there in Blackwater, though, I've noticed. I don't know. Come from, they just keep mm -mm. Somebody must be feeding them over there, drawing them in. Yeah. Now, who's CJ? Big oh. mouth of black water. Yeah, the big mouth of go. black water. That's the perfect way to describe He does a lot of caterwauling. Is that right? <laughs> All right, okay. He's caterwauling after every lady with a skirt. Every single one, huh? I forgot to ask you, Peppy, are you from St. Denis? Well, 
Quite honestly, I'm, I spend, uh, I'd say I'm more from Valentine. I do spend a lot of time down here just because this is where my wife likes to spend most of her time, but I do most of my work up around the Valentine area, so I come down here to visit as much as I can. But now that I know you folks, I can promise you I'm going to spend some more time down in Blackwater. Valentine's not far from Blackwater. You should come to one of uh, our tea tabs. Now, wait, yes, well, tell, that's, tell me that's when it I, is. I would love to. That's what I went to. That's where CJ did the singing and the playing, and we heard the marshal sing and play there oh, also. Oh, it was just quite lovely. Now, when is the next one, Miss Granny? Well, uh, right now they don't really have a, a, a set time, as it were. Mm -mm. But um, it's kind of impromptu, you know. We, we just All right. Sit down, take a break, and have tea time. But we're talking about maybe doing um, scheduled tea times. Well, at least once a week. Well, if I give you my telegram number, would you be so kind as to send me a note sometime if one gets scheduled? Oh, oh, pardon. Is there a reason why you had to bump me with your horse? I'd love to have you. Oh, I would love to be there. Oh, by the way, I did get the telegrams from both of you as well. I don't remember if I yes. responded or not. Okay. You, you did. You did. Oh. I heard from you. Oh, you're you're uh, fine. I, I was just by, passing on my telegram number. Yeah, I, I do have it. I appreciate you giving that info to me. Mm -hmm. Never know when you might need to reach out and... That's and, exactly and, right. And, and, ...and call someone. Mm-hmm. Well, y'all going to take the boat back to Blackwater? Uh oh, it's gone. Oh, it is. Oh, maybe. If you have oh. your telegram, I'll go ahead and I'll commit it to my memory. It is uh, YBG25203. Alright, so that's YBG25203. Yes, ma'am. Alright. And uh, what's your full name? Because uh, you said there's two pappies. I don't want to get them mixed yeah, up. I, I, have to get them I, am, I am Pappy Ghoul. My last name is spelled G O U L. Alright. Alright, I'll, uh, I'll put you in my address book. And I'll that would be amazing. I appreciate that. Well, folks, this is uh, this is where I'm going to part ways, but I certainly do appreciate the invitation and spending time with you tonight. It was wonderful to see you, Pappy. Mm, well, I will Pappy. see, I will see you all soon. I promise you. Mm -hmm. Right, you take care. All right, Miss May May, pleasure to meet you. Miss Granny, pleasure to meet you, young lady. Oh, yes, uh, yes, sir. Just FYI, uh, Saturday, mm -hmm. 7 p.m. Valentine, they're having uh, uh, some type of festival. Uh, so. I think I oh, saw that in Desdemona's shmud. telegram. Yeah, the shmud, yes. yeah, the Valentine schmud somewhere or another. Yep. That's it. Well, I know, all right, uh, folks. I know Blackwater were planning a music festival. A mu? Now we oh. talking? Uh huh. Our last one was a success, so we're gonna have us a full-on music festival this time around. I like it. Do you know when is that one scheduled? Any idea, or are they just talking about it right now? They're just talking about it right now. Okay. I, I think I got a date here. Uh, let me see. I think it was going to be on the 25th. The 25th? 25th. Yes, because that's when we're also having the masturbating place. The, the what now? <laughs> what is it? I'm going to go get the, I'm gonna go get the boat. It, you, is that some, like some kind of fishing competition? Yes, that's, that's exactly what it is. <laughs> oh, see, all right. Oh, Who can oh, bait yeah. the rod the quickest? We, we're gonna so there's a fellow named Richard Cheese um, from Blackwater and he's gonna teach a, a masturbating class and he's gonna have oh. Granny sit in there because I'm a senior masturbator and uh, we're gonna teach what? folks how to actually use their rod and catch fish. So you and this Mr. Dick Cheese are gonna teach everyone how to become masturbators. Yes, and we're gonna get them certified. Certifications certified. and everything. Well, ain't that something? Oh yeah. Something to hang on the wall. Yes, ma'am. All right. Mm -hmm. Oh my. Hey, it was a pleasure, y'all. that before the the music festival. Or but, okay, so everybody's become going to become masturbators before the music festival. Yes, sir. Yes. Sounds about right. For Blackwater, oh, yeah, that goodness. sounds right up, right up. <laughs> so Blackwater apparently needs a whole bunch of masturbators walking around. Gonna get I em. think it's gonna be for the whole state, you know. Oh, I see. Everywhere. Oh no! 
Oh, Ready? goodness. I'm trying to line it up, but I'm floating there. All right, oh, have a good night, y'all. Have a good night, Have a good one. I'll, I'll see you soon. All right, see you around. You're right there, mate.